another video I know I just uploaded yesterday, but I was super excited to try out these hornworms and excuse my lipstick. I'm trying something new. It's a little bit out of my comfort zone, but I'm just going to go with it. So um, these are the hornworms. I got them at the Kansas City Reptile Show that I went to Sunday. If you haven't seen my video on that, you can go ahead and check that out. And I got some other stuff as well. And um, I was super excited to try these out. They were... Uh, more on the pricey side, these are kind of like a uh, treating your animal meal kind of thing, if <laughs> that kind of makes sense. It's kind of like how we go to Red Lobster for like a treat meal um, for like a birthday or something. But I just picked these up because I went to the show anyways, so I just wanted to try them. And if you don't know what um, a hornworm looks like, they're basically like these little green things with a horn on their head and I was um, kind of afraid at first um, that the horn would hurt them when they eat them but the horn is actually super flexible and it couldn't hurt them at all really and all of my lizards really love them I didn't really get a video of Juby my Emerald Swift catching it um, I'm sorry about that I know that he's kind of in a nuisance to film because um, he's really shy and skittish, that's what Emerald Swift's kind of their thing is, but um, he did eventually eat it afterwards once I stepped away from the, um, with the camera, and he did eventually eat it, but he didn't eat it on camera, and I apologize for that, but hopefully the videos are still interesting to you. Um, I wouldn't, I would definitely recommend this to anybody who has a reptile, um, amphibian, and stuff like that. I'm not sure if snakes can eat them, I'm not sure if they would be interested in them, but, um, I was kind of worried that they wouldn't eat them because they don't really move and that's kind of what lizards go after they like to catch things that's kind of what they eat but these actually they actually did like them so and my Chinese water dragon it kind of fell into the water but it ate it in the water anyways I think it kind of helped it being in the water because it kind of floated and moved a little bit um, if you're having trouble with your animal eating them, maybe put them in a water bowl or something, I don't know, but that will drown it for sure, but um, it might help them want to catch it because it's moving, but yeah, hopefully you enjoyed these videos, I was super excited to watch my animals eat them, hopefully you are as well, so thanks for watching.